Yeah, hello, my name is Martin and on this video I like to show you the difference between CS5 and Topaz in masking. I've got the background layer with the landscape and the layer of the model. I've done the two masks, the one with Topaz Grimast 2 and the other one with the new brush and refine edge tool and the CS5. I'd like to show you the masks first. So here we have the mask of the CS5. Zoom in on the 50%. Here you have the mask of the CS5. And here you have the mask of the Topaz. And if I click the two layers, the one with the CS5 and the one with the Topaz, you might see a little different between them. So here on the jacket, it's not a big difference, but a little bit between the CS5 you see now and now on the Topaz. You get down in the arm here, here we have the CS5, here we have the Topaz, and even on the other side we have the Topaz now here and the CS5. So now we zoom in with 100% and we click away the CS5. So this is the Topaz, the CS5. We go upwards a little bit. We've got the CS5, we've got the Topaz. We go here to the hair area, here we have the topaz, and this is the CS5, upwards a little bit, the CS5 and the topaz, on the other side the topaz and the CS5, and even on this area we take a look on the CS5, and the topaz. Yeah, it's okay on both sides. Depends a little bit how good you are with the brush tool, how exactly you paint in all the all the colors you have to choose with the tools. Even on the, the CS5 or the topaz you've got different colors you can paint with. You can choose the hardness and both tools. So it depends a little bit how exactly you paint and what you've done with your mask. And this is not all I like to show you. I even like to show you a little trick and here I use the mask of the CS5. It's a, it's a very little trick. It's um, sometimes helpful to use this trick and it doesn't matter if you use the, the trick on the, on the mask with the CS5 or the Topaz or which other mask you like to choose this trick on. So here it is. We get a layer copy and this layer we set to the overlay. And now take a look what happened if I use the layer or I'm not using the layer. This is the mask or the composing without the special layer and here it is with the special layer. 
and we get down on the jack a little bit with the special layer or without the layer. We zoom on the other side and take a look here on the jack and the hair area without the special layer and with the special layer. And here on the flying hairs we can take a look on all this flying hairs what happened now with the special layer or without the special layer. Um, you have to play a little bit. It's not good to use overlay always. You can even choose the soft light, you can choose a hard light, you can choose maybe on some pictures screen or lightened and even here we've got effect with lighten or screen and on other images it's maybe better to use darken or multiply now I'd like to show you the multiply also or maybe the darken and I have to say on this special image I like to choose the overlay or I like to choose the screen and I might say on this it's the screen which is better take even on this side with special or without so you can change the opacity a little bit maybe um, to change the effect of the screen mode and I like to say this is the best effect you can have on the layer mask on this composing with a screen and the opacity you like to use 70% or maybe down to 50% it depends a little bit play with it play with the blending modes and you will see it's very helpful to do this you can even copy this layer two times or three times sometimes it's better to you to have more copies to so play with this I hope you like this trick I hope you enjoy this special view on CS5 and the Topaz Remax 2 now we see you the next time bye